assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to seven engineers youtube channel guys you can see practically this is floor beam construction design guys you can see clearly depth of this floor beam is 18 inches width is 12 inches which is designed for four story commercial building you can see guys we have three steel rods at the bottom three at the top to our side bars dia is 16 millimeter this is the proper design of steel reinforcement for floor beam. Next guys you can see stirrup spacing is okay. Hooks are bent on 135 degrees so this is also best. Three steel rods at the bottom. Three at the top. Two are side bars. Dia is 16 mm. Designed for four story commercial building. Stirrup dia is 8 mm. Spacing is 6 inches. Or you can say 150 mm. Hooks you can see which are provided alternately. So this is the proper way to design simply supported beam. They have structural drawing. According to structural drawing they designed this floor beam. Hooks are okay. Spacing is okay. Steel dia is okay. The first stirrup is placed with minimum 2 inches so it's okay. Guys you can see clearly this is column. Spacing is from 100 to 150 mm. From 4 to 6 inches. To the distance of L by 4 we have about 4 to 5 inches. Then we have 6 inches so it's okay. As you can see clearly. Let me show you the other guys you can see that is the column they will provide when they put this floor beam inside the farm work they will place extra steel rods guys you can see here they didn't provide crank bar or extra bar but they will provide extra bars here Guys, you can see clearly. Everything is okay in this construction. Only they did not provide the development length. So development length is important to provide at the end of the beam to make a good bond between steel and concrete. Hope this short video can help you. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.